Well, hey, now, we made it to August 1st, tomorrow. And uh, just a little teaser about what's coming up, I guess I'll call it. But uh, this weekend, we're going to go up north, Tammy and I, and uh, take the toy hauler and the four chihuahuas and some grub and go meet some friends of ours. Uh, a fellow by the name of Tom is having an outing up there. And we're going to go up there and hunt some gold and get into the trees and a little cooler weather. I think the highs up there this weekend will only be like 90 and probably some rain. Pretty nice weather when you've been down here cooking. So we're going to do that and see some friends. And uh, I'll get some stuff for you. But the reason I'm posting this is simply because I'm not sure if I'll have a phone signal up there or be able to uh, upload any videos while I'm actually on this hunt. If I can, I will. And I'd like to share it with you as we go along, but sometimes that's just not possible. And uh, it's a neat area up there, really neat area. And it's different than hunting down here in the desert. And I'll go into that when I'm up there. And hopefully I'll find some gold. And in the upcoming months, uh, the end of August and going into September, we start hitting the road quite a bit and getting out into some really interesting areas, exploring some mines. We've got amazing spots we're going to be going to, parts of the Arizona desert and the mountains here that otherwise most people never ever get a chance to see because <laughs> it got more sense than to go out there or they just won't ever have a chance to go out there and I think part of being on YouTube and, and putting this stuff up and having followers that actually watch you, it's really neat to be able to show more than just going out there and digging a couple holes and go, yeah, look at the nugget. Um, I like to give you a good idea of where we are, why we're there, what the countryside looks like, and what kind of critters even we've got in those areas. So yeah, this is a little, just a little short ditty to let you know that if I vanish for a few days on and off here coming up into the fall and the winter, it's simply because I'm out in the field. And a lot of the places I go, there is no phone signal. There is no texting. There is no television. You're lucky to even get radio. And when I go off to these places, I could be absent for four or five days at a pop. But I won't forget about you guys, and I'll sure come back and uh, show you what I've been up to and uh, maybe give you some tips on uh, how to hunt these areas and what club claims I'm on, you know, by the, by the club itself. And this weekend we're going to be up on some Roadrunner and some GPAA claims, and I think there's some open ground up there too. And uh, I'll be sharing that with you. So I just wanted to let you know if I'm visibly absent for three or four days here coming up, it's simply because I'm out in the field. And they just don't put cell phone towers everywhere out here. And for right now, hopefully I'll be able to uh, talk to you folks this coming weekend. But if not, I'll get you out until I get home.